Good morning! It is Magnus Helberg here in Los Angeles with my daily dashboard update on February September. 28th. Did I say September? Try February, February 28th. <laughs> February 28th, 2012, September. I regressed to September. I don't know why. Something good happened in September? Must have. <laughs> it is February 28th. And because of leap year, this is not the last day of the month. It is almost the last day of February. It is 48 degrees here in Topanga Canyon this morning. It was cold. It was frost on the car this morning. And uh, it was really, really cold last night. And, uh, well, it's 48 right now. That's about 20 degrees cooler than it has been in the last few days. Anyway, again, we got beautiful sunshine here in Los Angeles, and I'm here with my good friend Scott Carmody. We're talking about some different reports today. We heard about real estate. One report that I read from the Realtor magazine was that, uh, you know, sales are up and things are looking up. Well, later I found out that uh, that was contracts, not closed deals. So what's your take on that, Scott? Well, contracts being up, I can totally understand because... If every time an offer is written and submitted, it counts as a contract, there's a lot of offers being written. Most of them are lowball and don't go anywhere. A lot of them are on short sale properties that never come to fruition. So there's a lot of contracts being written, but I, I just, I don't know. I don't know that that's an indicator, uh, frankly, of anything. That's my take on that part. Well, I also heard that prices were down for, uh, they just said on the radio that pr prices were down in a bunch of markets. Uh, did you hear that too? Yeah, actually, I think what it was was um, 20 markets, and you know, when they say a market, they mean a city. Uh, 20 markets um, surveyed, uh, sales volumes were down in 18 of them for the month of December, and they said that was for the fourth year in a row. Um so, you know, that's the, the, the freshest data they have for us. But I can tell you that it's a hell of a lot busier now than it was a couple months ago in December. Yeah, well, I actually have a, a pretty good December. I guess it depends a little bit. But, uh, yeah, I mean, it sure feels busy. But, uh, again, there's a lot of busy work, a lot of showings, a lot of this, a lot of that. Offers written, like you said, low offers that doesn't go anywhere and so forth. But uh, here in Los Angeles, at least, it seems like we have pretty decent activity. It is also, speaking of activity, the open house day today is the caravan in LA. We're going to go and look at a couple of things, I think. Uh, you want to see something specific, specifically today, Scott? Yeah, Larry Young has got a new listing in the Westwood Hills for $1,369,000, I believe. I want to go see that. And... Uh, and I think Matthew O'Keefe has something on Glenroy, though it did not say that it was open today. But I'd like to check and see if that's open as well. Also in uh, in Lower Bel Air. All right. Well, those are good. Uh, that's good stuff. Good stuff. Sounds like a good price right there in uh, Westwood Hills for a million three something. Yeah, it's a uh, 1,400 square feet or 1,500 square feet. But the house looks great, sounds great. Uh, so we'll go see it. All right, then. This is Magnus Helberg at thepartnerstrust.com signing off from a uh, cold but sunny Los Angeles. 48 degrees. My daily dashboard update on February 28th, 2012. It's also scott.comedy at thepartnerstrust.com. Wishing you a fabulous Tuesday wherever you're at. And goodbye. We'll see you tomorrow. We will see you tomorrow. Take care, LA. Thanks for watching. Like tie. Actually, I guess we won't see them tomorrow. They'll see us tomorrow. Oh, yeah. They'll, they'll see us tomorrow. Oh, what a joy that is. Indeed. Have a great day. Goodbye.